everyone knows that it's good to start investing. But very few people actually invest. The rear sons include lack of knowledge about investing and the cognitive burden of making a set of desi. Signs about how much to invest, where to invest and when to invest. According to this survey, 1. 40% of millennials feel they don't have enough money to start investing in the stock market and they believe it takes a lot of money to get started. Many fintech companies have been trying to make investing simpler and demystify the process of investing. Robo-advisors like Wealthfront and Betterment enable users to start investing in just a few clicks. Taking this even a step further, Spare change investing apps like Acorns and Stash even take away the burden of deciding to in invest by investing the spare change amount from each transaction of their users. With the recent growth in cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin and Ethereum, many people have taken to investing in cryptocurrencies. Some famous investors like Fred Wilson, 2. And Jamath, 3 have asserted that one should have at least 1% of their portfolio invested in cryptocurrencies. This has led to the meteoric rise of Bitcoin and other crypto tokens. Figure 1. In recent months at attracting more and more investors to this asset class.